So in this question then, we're asked to sketch the graph y equals the natural log of the mod of x. So how do we do this? Well, Basically, a little bit of background that you should know, and that is that if we take a particular graph, y equals f of x, let's just say this one here, then when it comes to looking at y equals f of the mod of x, this is what happens. You end up with just taking the side to the right of the y-axis, this part here, which I've sketched below, and when you've drawn that part in, you've got to then take this part and reflect it in the y-axis. So you'll get something looking like this for this graph up here. So when we're looking at this graph, what we need to do is look at the graph of y equals just the natural log of x without the mod in. And if we were to sketch that, you should know that it looks something like this. It approaches the y-axis, never crosses it, so the y-axis is an asymptote. Okay, The curve comes up through 1 on the x-axis and then just starts to bend away like this. So that's the graph of y equals natural log of x. Now you'll notice in this graph, we're quite lucky actually, we've got nothing on the left of the y-axis. So we don't even have to worry about removing the left-hand part. All we need to do is just take this right-hand part and reflect it in the y-axis. So if we sketch this right-hand part again, okay, we'll just do that. We know that it crosses the x-axis at the point 1, 0. Okay, we'll just put 1, 0 in there. And all I need to do is just reflect this part then in the y-axis, and what we get is this. So this is the graph now then of y equals the natural log of mod x. We've also got to say where it crosses the coordinate axis. Well, clearly it doesn't cross the y-axis because it's an asymptote, but we've got this point here, which is a mirror image of this point 1, 0. So this point is going to be negative 1, 0. All right?